Oh, didn't see you there. Oh, I've just come, we're coming back up through Wales, back up the, the heart of uh, Wales, you know, and uh, we're following this line again, what's central, uh, central um, Wales line. And uh, we've got a viaduct, and it's one of two viaducts on the uh, central uh, Wales line. Uh, this is the one furthest south, and then there's another one further north. But this one, I can't pronounce it, but I'll, I'll write it on here and tell you what it is. But uh, we're going to go down and have a close look and show you underneath the arches. But it's some span. I don't know, I, can, I can't see all the arches, but how many is there? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten. There's at least 12 then. There's probably another five. You know, it's, it's like... It's like up our way, we've got Ribblehead, and that's a big viaduct. But that's that's something else, that is. That's quite, you know, Ribblehead's in a in a, a moorland, but this is between two valleys. Um, it's some, and it's single track as well. Even though Ribblehead's single track, but it used to be two track, but this is actually single track. I bet you when you're going across it, remember in the old DMUs, I bet you like, I bet it was dead scary looking out front because there'd only be low, low walls, you know, and you'd be going along there or you'd be on steam and you look out and there's just a massive drop. It's pretty good. Some, some, uh, some architecture, isn't it, that? Looks like it's got a farm underneath of it. But we'll, we'll go and have a look, I think. We'll get back in the car and go and have a look. So, we've made it down to the uh, oh, a very windy uh, graveyard because right underneath the viaduct there's a little graveyard and all the, because we're in Wales, all the uh, tombstones are in Welsh there's no English ones so anyway, we're in this little graveyard and this is the viaduct down the bottom and it was built in 1868 and it's, um, I was nearly right, I, I said 12 arches, a bit longer than 12 arches it's actually 18 arches long and it's a thousand foot long as well so it's a way distance and uh, it's just over 100 foot uh, high um, but like I say it was built in 1868 but it was refurbed from 2014 to 2016 so it must have all got repointed so all those brick must have all got repointed and it must have I bet it was I bet it was sort of crumbling away in places. I bet it was a bit a bit sketchy on top. And he might have reballasted it and put new track down as well. So they've uh, referred it. And that's a good number of years ago now, that's what four years ago now since it got refurbed. Uh, so I might I'll have a look and see if there's any photos of it when it getting refurbed. There may be some old photos when it was, you know, I don't know, 50s, 60s, maybe earlier. Uh, see if we can get some old photos of it, maybe old photos of this churchyard. There'll be some about, we'll find some. Put them in. Um, but it's some that... Uh, it's pretty amazing because you're in this small valley and then all of a sudden there's a big viaduct next to you. It's great. I like it a lot, I approve. It's good.
Well, like the one in um, the one up our way, Riverhead, it's actually got big drain pipes coming down the side, but this hasn't got anything. So the water, you can actually see on the arches where the water's been running down when it's been raining. So I must, it must drip the water when it's when it's chucking it down. Um, but yeah, it's an interesting. Every every viaduct's diff different. You know, not, none of them are really the same. That's pretty cool. That. And, uh, and in the top of the arch, it's it's like a it's more of a brick. You know, like a like a house brick. But then the rest is all big stone. But it's just got like little quaint little bricks at the top, completing every arch. So that's interesting. It's a a design, a, a design, um, like you, you know. Um, yeah, yeah. Pretty good. I like it a lot. Pretty good. Oh, is it? There's a new island up the back here, but that reminds me, before you go, remember to subscribe, like, comment, always leave a comment, and uh, click that big bell. Ding!